Hi, everybody. This is uh, Silvio Canto in Dallas, uh, Texas, on Thursday, August the 6th, and welcome to our video commentary. You may have heard that Sally Yates uh, was before the Senate Judiciary Committee yesterday talking about these FISA warrants that were issued uh, in the transition of the Trump administration, maybe even before that. And of course, uh, these have become very controversial because it's obvious now that these uh, FISA warrant requests were based on a piece of paper or information that turned out to be wrong. So in other words, the court was asked to issue a warrant and it was based on information that was politically motivated and perhaps even paid for by uh, the Clinton campaign. So the whole thing was a big no-no. These judges were obviously told to issue a warrant based on information that it should have never, uh, should have never been approved. Now, they asked Sally Yates about it, and she tried to dodge the question, saying, well, I would have never signed it if I, was, if I knew what was, on the, on the, it was in the information. And she tried to basically blame uh, former FDI Director Comey, but I don't think that's going to work. I mean, somebody has to be held accountable. I think this is beyond party and beyond Trump. You know, the FISA warrant is a pretty serious thing. But the FISA warrant gives the existing administration, the incumbent administration, tremendous powers to go out and investigate an American citizen. And if you're going to do that, you better tell the judges the truth. And in this case, somebody misled the judges. You cannot explain it any other way. Somebody told the judge, give me a warrant. And they did it on information that was completely false. So I, I don't think Sally Yates is going to get out of this one, and I think a lot of other people are not going to get out of this one. We need to know. We need to know who was behind this, who was uh, behind what apparently looks like people who were spying on the Trump administration or the Trump uh, transition team. So I'm sure there's going to be more details on this coming up. Thank you for watching, and if today is your birthday, happy birthday. Bye-bye, everybody.